about two weeks after that, I'm sat watching my fish having breakfast and, um, and I'm labouring on a building site then. Went right back to the beginning of construction, labouring on a building site and I'm watching my fish and I'm worshipping my fish and I'm thinking, my fish are beautiful. And suddenly I had this thought, it's like God speaking to me saying, yes, they are beautiful. I made those fish. And it's like, whoa, that's amazing. Yeah, God made my fish. Wow, why am I worshipping these fish? I should be worshipping God. You know, and my neighbours had given me this leaflet called Journey Through Life, uh, which had a prayer in the back of it. It said, you know, say sorry, thank you, please, and invite Jesus into your life. And I did that. And uh, my life changed instantly. Instantly. I stopped swearing. I didn't even realise it. People were saying to me, hey, what's happened to you? You're different. You, you, you're talking different. No, I'm not. Yes, you are. You're, you're talking different. No, 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 no. It took me three days to realise that I'd actually stopped swearing. I was delivered from swearing on the day that I invited Jesus into my life. But then an incredible thing happened after that. Because the real transformation came. Uh, a few months later when God gave me the gift of rhyming words and uh, and that happened in a prayer meeting and um, I, I've been a Christian for about I, 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 get, I invited Jesus into my life in May 1986 and in September 1986 I'm sat in a prayer meeting you know so work that out you know it's four months down the road and uh, and I'm getting all these words coming into my head like a song. It's Christmas, Christmas, Christmas unwrapped, Christmas unwrapped, it's Christmas, Christmas, Christmas unwrapped for you. Whose party is it anyway? I hear you say on Christmas Day. I don't really care, I just have a good time with turkey, tinsel, and plenty of wine. And all these words were coming into my head like that. And I couldn't get them out. The next day, I mean, as I went to bed, there's even more words coming into my head. The next day, my mate, who's a Christian uh, as well, uh, turned up at my house because we were working together and I said Dave have you have you ever heard this song and so I did the song a bit and he says no where did you hear that and I said well it, it was in my head last night at the prayer meeting and he says you're a numpty aren't you that's God gave you that last night God's speaking to you he's speaking to you in rhyme man get on it you know and it's like oh okay 